Hello folks, Buffalo here. Today we're going to shoot the uh, Mossberg Model 500 410. You know when I uh, tell people I really enjoy shooting the 410 shotgun, they get that weird look in their eye. And I can just see they're imagining me with a uh, some kind of little youth model breakdown 410 or something. But this here is an actual adult size pump action shotgun. It just happens to be chambered in 410. Although uh, shields can be expensive for these little guns, they are a blast to shoot. Now, this shotgun is uh, chambered for two and three quarter or three inch shells. It'll hold the uh, it'll hold five up here in the tube and one in the chamber, giving you a total capacity of six. And here's a two and a half inch. Here's a three inch. You can mix them and match them any way you want. Now this gun uh, does not accept screw-in chokes. It comes uh, with a fixed full choke in it, but you can still shoot slugs through a full choke. Some people think you can't, but you can. Here's a slug right here. Let's shoot a few through it. Now those propane canisters were empty. They were just old ones I had laying around. But uh, you can see that that slug, uh, that's a quarter ounce slug. I think it's about 110 grains uh, bullet weight. But you can see that it broke in half and left two equally sized holes on that exit of that last propane canister. All right, I got an old uh, spray paint can set up over there that's got, it feels like it's about a third of the way full. Let's see what it does with the slug. Man, that thing ripped that can apart. Uh, I know people that deer hunt with a 410. I don't, but uh, it'd be it'd be an okay weapon to use in a uh, where you was going to make most of your shots close range. And on a gun like this, it's got the double bead. You've got one here and one here, so you can line them up almost like rifle sights and get pretty good accuracy out of them. And another thing I want to hit on on these Mossbergs is I love the location of this safety. Uh, my dad lost his right eye when he was a kid, so he had to teach us. He had to learn how to shoot left-handed, and he taught us how to shoot. And the Mossbergs were always, you know, more convenient for him because of the location of the safety, kind of a ambidextrous position there. So I'm just going to summarize by saying this would be a, uh, this is an excellent gun for rabbit, squirrel, small game like that. Uh, give this gun a chance. It's a full-size gun full size length of pull on it, made well, you know, most Mossberg pumps seem to be made pretty well, they're tough, but uh, give it a look, Buffalo signing out.